Welcome back to Gar's Graveyard Garage. We are gonna work on the giveaway truck, the 1980 Chevy Love. We got it running. Hopefully it runs again. It's been sitting here since we worked on it. Uh, but we need to get it running on its own fuel system, get the brakes working, and actually test drive this thing. So we'll be uh, going through everything front to back because whoever ends up with this truck, we want to make sure it's legit. So here we go. What's going on everybody? We're gonna uh, try and get this thing started. So I've got that one and that one and that one. So we're gonna uh, throw a battery in this thing and see if we can get it started and get it over to the garage. But we need to go get Gizmo out of the way. So we're gonna do that first. Remember with the love, I can still hear you. Huh? You <laughs> get over here. Tito, go home. Hey buddy. Hey buddy. Garth. Come here. Garth. No, sir. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Needs air. Well, as long as it rolls. <laughs> I think it's taking air. Yeah, it's coming up. This one is hyper today. We haven't touched this thing in Won't so long. No one alone. No, what's that doing? There. Oh, there's a battery in it. <laughs> oh, that's good. Move, Garth. Been a while since we gave the love some love. Yeah. Maybe I'll find some of the tools I'm missing. Do you know how satisfying this pressure wash is going to be? Oh, that's why I haven't done it. I can't wait. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> I already called Dib, so Dad did what I to say. Is there anything in the cylinder? We're not going to start working on it until we get over there. I can't believe the smog pump's not froze up. <laughs> It's a Chevy, it'll be fine. No, this is a Suzu. <laughs> yeah, well. Can I help you? <laughs> Garth, quit eating him. Wait, Garth, keep eating him. Hey. <laughs> You're a little turd. You're cute though. 
Let's see if I can find the keys. Let's see if we got power. One of your five million keys in your pocket. Got it. I think this is the key. <laughs> it's the only goofy looking key I have that doesn't go to a tractor. That is a weird key. Yeah, we got power on the dash. Oh, this actually has a clutch switch. Come on, love. The fuel pump only primes when you're the engine's turning. We might need to prime it. I hear a vacuum. Huh? I hear a like suction every time you do that. Yeah, let's prime it. It's a tight squeeze. Yeah. <laughs> There's a Mopar in my way. Let's see if it's getting fuel. Let it sit too long. Nothing in the filter. Yeah, let's give it a splash. <laughs> so we changed the fuel pump on this. Did you? I think you were here. Was I? I believe. Make I sure have to no. go watch the video again. Remember, it's been a while. She's happy. Staying running. Huh? Staying running, that's good. Just needed a little shot. Yep. She needed the go-go juice. <laughs> it smells like a lawnmower mixed with pine salt. Uh, okay. <laughs> That's weird. to be getting gas. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably going up, that, that uh, filter's probably crusty, it's probably going up through the middle of it. It's a fun little truck. <laughs> There's no brake, so Dad's taking it nice and slow. But she goes. She definitely moves under her own power, though. No, the engine, I mean, well, the engine only has, what do we have, 50, 52? 53? 53,000 miles on it. <laughs> Such a cute little truck. 
No, it's fun. It's like a go kart go kart mixed with a pickup truck. <laughs> Just got to get the lift on it, and oh, I'm saying too much. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's the biggest bed I have seen on a truck this small. Though. Well, that's considered a long bed. Only <laughs> like fifty-five thousand on it. Mm -hmm. Fifty, yeah. Good job, Bobby. Oh yeah, I forgot the big old spare is actually still under there. Oh yeah. We probably, I don't know where the gas tank is. We might have to take it. That's a cool tire too. <laughs> oh, there's the gas tank. Uh, well, it's shiny on the outside. That's good. I wonder if it has a drain plug on it. That would be great. Um, son, you want to grab the jack stands? The, the the larger ones. I think they're sitting out somewhere. Uh, to the right of the garage. In the front. Unless you moved them. Yeah, we'll get the fuel system tackled first, and then we'll let's let let well let's get the truck up. Come on, Jack. Wake up. It says it's cold and it don't wanna. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> In our next episode of Gar's Graveyard Garage, <laughs> we rebuild a jack. Yes. What is... Finally. Good gosh. Is the handle tied all the way? Yes. This thing's just got air bubbles or gas or Taco Bell. I don't know. Something. I hope we wouldn't have Taco Bell because you're on that receiving end. No, he is. No. <laughs> This one gives side toots. <laughs> Ellie, what's all over your lick? Uh, probably from Garth's mouth. Oh, probably. He gave me muddy kisses this morning. This is how high we need to jack it up. That'd be cool. What lift do you put it on? <laughs> There's not, not many options for these things. Probably like four inch, maybe. Well, on this side, you could flip the springs, oh, yeah. throw them on top of the axles, but the front, yeah, not happening. Father and son are all bonding. Oh, you're not supposed to be filming that part. <laughs> <sighs> Everyone's going to be so proud I'm using jack stands. <laughs> oh, forgot my safety goggles. <laughs> I don't, I mean, you don't need those until the gas tank opens. Figure out what's in No, there. not some of our, our viewers. They think I should just walk through life wearing safety goggles. We're not corporate. <laughs> <laughs> We're not OSHA certified. Maybe a fire resistance, you know. All right, it's not falling. Oh, yeah. There's my beanie. Uh, it looks like... Jacked it from me. Muppet's not wearing hers, and I jacked Dad's. Ew. Oh, yeah. Check is. out the hoodie. This gas tank is so tiny. Tech gallon. How's the weather down there, Dad? Rusty. <laughs> oh. This one has torsion arms. So we can actually turn these up a little bit. They're way up. We can actually jack up the, the front by just turning these torsion bars up. Huh. That'll add a little bit. Yeah, it's all surface dressed. I mean, this thing is solid. All right. Let's just come off of here. <laughs> There's a shield. Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> Steven, your turn. Take that off. Okay. <laughs> no, no, the, the heat shield. Oh, okay. There's, uh, looks like two bolts in the back and like two in the front. <laughs> Don't make it shiny. You were going to need wrenches for this side because they're... Is there a nut? This and not like this. A what? Oh, okay.
Please don't let that fall on your face. <laughs> they come off? Oh, well that was easy. There's only two on this side. Okay, I see how it's held up over here. We're gonna need a... Uh, oh, you're as wide as I am. Deep sockets. Jesus. <laughs> Why are you talking to yourself? <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to get these kind of tires. Yeah. Because these are... These are gnarly. They probably don't make this kind anymore. These are very outdated, but I love this, the way they did the tread back then. I want to build something we can actually go off-roading and mudding in. As well, eventually, when we finally get Zombug real done, not just for looks. Yeah. I gotta find some axles. Though. Yeah, it's a new fuel pump. <laughs> no one right above me. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I just looked up and saw one shiny object. I don't think I was here for that. I don't remember if you were or not. I think I was here for the making it run. I remember that. You get to a point you need me to hold this, just tell me. So I can let it fall on your face. I mean, hold it for you. Hey. <laughs> oh, this thing don't weigh nothing. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm just chilling right now. At least they're on studs. That's nice. Yeah. I was afraid it was going to be a... <laughs> Careful, Riley. Huh? You okay? What's she do? She spilled a little bit of the water. I think it went on her foot. Oh. Oh, I well, know something. Did else. it go on you? <laughs> Hold on her leg. I love you. Thank you. <laughs> Will you get the lid off my jacket for me? Why does everyone in our family a klutz? We blame you. <laughs> no. No, her mom and your mom. <laughs> and who's the one ke who keeps lighting himself on fire? That's just because I'm, I'm hot. <laughs> hey. All my friends think so. <laughs> <laughs> Call me. No, no. <laughs> I'm not telling any of them to watch this. <laughs> oh, God. Because they might get excited and text me. Huh, what's dad's number? <laughs> All these kids keep calling me John Wick now. So. <laughs> Little Wick. <laughs> yeah, I blame your Uncle Will for that one. I love Uncle Will. <laughs> I almost got this one. Are you sure? That, the fact that a, what, eight or nine year old said that to you yesterday? Yeah, yeah. How, how old is Julian? Nine. Nine? Okay. Yeah, yeah, he called me John Wick. <laughs> I don't know how old he is. But his mom is also a nerd, too, so. No, oh, no, I heard it. Which way does it need to go? Oh, that way? I'm just holding it up. You got it where you need it. Yeah, it's bent. Huh? Bent? Not bent. It's the. <laughs> you you got to give me more than one word. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Dad. Come on. Oh! What are you trying to do? You need a pry bar or something? <laughs> this side's stuck. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Okay. A little tough love? Yeah, a little bit. Scissors. There's three on this side. Three on this side as well. Okay. And the fuel lines are going to... Are they going up on top of the tank? The metal lines up there? On top. Yes. On the, they're all going to the top. No, not that metal line. I know. That's these brakes. Here. <laughs> the three that up there on this side. Oh, these ones? Yeah. Are they all in the top or in the side? Looks like they're going to the top. Yeah, they're on the top. They're right here. Okay. Yeah, way up there. Well, we're not taking the bed off this truck because that's. So, yeah, we'll just. Uh, I guess that's a 12 also. It's going to be a deep socket though. Uh, I found one part that's not in surface rust. Of course, it's in the bed. Oh, you might have to put a wrench on top of it. Yeah. <laughs> three right here are fine. Uh, these ones need deep socket. The other one doesn't. Okay. Those are 12s also? Yeah. Okay. Um, according to the gauge, if it's accurate, this thing has a half a tank of gas in it. So. <laughs> no drain plug? Uh, no. Dang it. And what's funny is they put a spot on the plate right mm -hmm. here 
where there would be one, and then there's a spot right here, the low spot. It's like they just never put it in. <laughs> Make your own. Mm. We're not going to blame Chevy. We're going to blame Isuzu. They did it. <laughs> okay, let me get you a deep 12, and we'll see if those come off or not. He's got one that's being a pain in the rump. Oh. Uh, well, you got to gotta be nice to the old girl. She... <laughs> Kind of, kind of crusty. Oh, you gotta put a wrench on the back. Yeah. That's what I was worried about. Ah. The only one that needs to. 1992. Mm -hmm. It's funny the plates. Mm -hmm. I love how it's sunk back in there. That was a terrible noise. <laughs> These, well, we're not gonna have to be replacing any brake lines. These are still shiny. <laughs> wow. The rubber hose is still flimsy. That's good. The thing was nice preserved, nice and preserved up there in the trees. There's not even holes in the muffler. Yeah. The only hole that I have found is right here, right here in the bed. No, oh, that's where. Oh, that's where the. Uh, the engine hoist is mounted up there. Ah. Huh? I know, these are cool. They don't do this style anymore. I've always liked BFGs anyways. How does that, how does that work? A little you just, washer came over here. I know. The side is done. I don't know, we'll put a flashlight So they light sell on. cheese blocks, or cuts of cheese blocks? Yeah, yeah for snacks. Oh, I remember so it said done. Yeah. Okay, well, let's be this careful. Flipped. <laughs> there's cheese blocks, there's cheese sticks. I know there's cheese sticks, we get the string cheese blocks. At least Man. that's a tiny tank. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> it's like a, it's Man, probably like a little... Ball. And we would That's cut probably the a cheese 16, blocks. maybe 12. Crackers. Kind of I, think most of these I know it's loud. Well, why isn't it falling on you then? <laughs> these are in a horrible spot. These are in a horrible spot. There's no room right here. <laughs> yeah. Well, be careful when you're taking them down because yeah. it will. I mean, it didn't. I don't hear any fluid in it. I don't hear it. I don't either. Knock on it. Wow. Well, the shocks are easy to do on this. This whole truck's just easy to work on. Mm -hmm. I love how nothing is rusted out. That is just awesome. <laughs> Dad wasn't ready and what? Ste Eyeballs. Steven got rust in his face. That's why you're supposed to wear safety goggles. Come on. <laughs> You want some? I have like ten, no. ten pairs. <laughs> no, Riley, it's okay, baby. No. <laughs> Do you need a shorter extension? No, it's the top. Oh. It's not coming off. We're just sizing today. We'll help in a little Is bit. It? <laughs> it sounded like it. I don't know where the top screw went, but it's somewhere. Bolt. <laughs> Get in the hole. So hard, so hard. <laughs> How many left? One. One? One. one. <laughs> Keep me posted. <laughs> it's, it's gonna. <laughs> well, then it's not like. <sighs> and make sure we get all these this back too. This spot's gonna be a pain. I can tell you that because there's like barely room for my fingers. I can't keep him around anymore. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here comes the last one. We 
yeah, it's definitely coming loose. <laughs> Is that it? What's holding it up? Oh, there's nothing in this thing. Yeah, there's nothing in there. I was thinking that holding it up. Uh, there's something on this side. Is there another one? There we go. Go for it. Just please don't kill my husband. Oh, come on. You're no fun. He hasn't taken a life insurance policy out yet. Oh, oh. That's my girl. Through my mom. Yeah, through your mom. <laughs> it's still a life insurance. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all are evil. There it went. No, please be careful. Okay, it's a rubber hose. Hold on. Okay, we got it down that low, so now I need to. Uh oh. Well, Hold on, let me see if I can figure out where to... There's the... What is that? That's the vent hose. Will it go that way any? Which way? That way. Oh. Oh, I think you got it. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I think I just caught that right at the perfect second. I got gas in my mouth. Oh, is there no. gas in it? There was in that line. Oh, so, in the line? <laughs> yeah. This one right here. Oh. How'd it taste, babe? Yeah, this one's uh, that one that just came out. Gas tank. Oh, that, that must be a return line. Oh, that's right. This has that fancy. Mm -hmm. Is it fresh gas? It smells like it. Yeah, yeah that's, a, that's one of the little tiny return lines. It's so small. It's, yeah, it is. Like... Okay, well, what we're gonna do is open this up because I think Riley's bigger than that gas tank. All right, actually, it doesn't smell bad. That's good. Oh, there's some in it. Let's see if anything comes out. Oh, <laughs> you can run a diesel on that. <laughs> it looks like dirty oil. It yeah, it's that's it's varnished. We're going to have to put some fresh gas down in there and we're going to have to... Go use my water. <laughs> Go wash your mouth up. Oh, there's another nut. They got the quarters. Sally, yeah. leave the door alone. Evil. She's not evil. She's evil. She's neglected. Oh, tank's got holes in it. Oh. Oh, yeah. Well. Well, this tank is shot. Okay. Well, I have to find one of those. Riley, you made a mess. No. Did you piddle on my driveway? No. <laughs> no. Yeah, it's just. Oh. I don't think it's supposed to do that. Well, I'm just. I was trying to see if. If I could patch it. No. <laughs> mm. No, it's it's there's rust outs all all over the place. Hey, Dad. Hmm. For shig will stomp your foot through the hole. No. <laughs> um, I guess we will. Uh... Hmm. Riley, stay away from this. Back up. Yeah, that'll track everywhere and get super gross. Um. Okay, I gotta see if I can find one of these. Yay. Yeah, that's what happened there. That got bent over. It, I mean, I could probably patch this, but this is so thin. Maybe? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if that... Well, does this... It comes apart, right? No. No? It just looks it's, like... That's a... where it's factory sealed. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, if I can't find a tank we're gonna have to clean this up real good and and i'll have to do some patchwork on it yeah i mean i've done it's just small holes not the, like a huge chunk yeah well yeah Does that mean the bottom of it was fine oh, bottom yeah the bo that's well, that's where i got excited i'm like well the bat the bottom looks good but no there's there's a hole there hole there hole there there it's all on that side there 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 yeah water was sitting on it mm. This side, this end's all good, huh? Okay, all the holes are over here. 
it might be passable, but I kind of doubt it. We can hope for the best. If that's steel, that's the other thing. Okay, well, let me go see if I can actually find a tank. Kind of doubt it. <laughs> Cannot find a fuel tank for this thing anywhere, so we are going to, I guess, attempt to patch this one. Let's get this, see this sending unit out of here first. All right, pulling this out will give us a good idea of how gross, <laughs> how gross it is. All well, those wires are. <laughs> Oh, oh goodness. <laughs> yeah, I'd say that's not working. <laughs> oh. How does it they make it that tight? Oh. oh. Mm. Yes, yeah, rubber seals in the way. It might work. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Ooh. There's still actually quite a bit down in there. It's so thick. That's why you didn't feel it sloshing. <sighs> yeah. No. <laughs> okay, well, let's get this goop into the drain pan and... Uh, put some kitty litter on that. Yeah, put some kitty litter on that and we'll see if we can... Uh, yeah. I'll save all the gunk in this for Iceman because we can recycle this oil and turn it into black diesel. I can throw it in his truck. <laughs> okay. Let's clean this up and then we'll attempt to weld. <laughs> this gas turned back into oil. Smell bad. Smell. <laughs> oh, you're right. Don't smell that. Mm-hmm. It's just not a full tank. It's not wanting to drain into it either. Oh. No, the Oh, Dad. Oh. Oh, uh, quit finding holes. <laughs> <laughs> Tell the holes to quit showing up. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I need a uh, screwdriver. The drain's apparently clogged. <laughs> Is it on this end? Yeah. So black you can't even tell it's in there. <coughs> oh, yeah, it leaves. <laughs> Riley, you were right. Yeah. There. How's the end of that screwdriver look? It's not. No, I mean, it's still it's still thin. Yeah, it'll. It'll make good diesel fuel, but... Ah. Why does nobody have this gas tank? It's so simple. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> that's a lot of welding. And that's very... No, that's... that's there. I'd have to put a full patch right here. Yeah, that is way too much. There's another hole right there. Just, oh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> I found a better plan. We're good on this side, at least. Really? <laughs> yeah, the other day your mom was standing here talking to me, and I said, there's a butterfly by your head, and all of a sudden it came, and it just went right on her forehead, gave her a kiss, and then took off. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Might be. We're in the country. Yeah, well, there's a shooting range over there, a shooting range over there, and the one in my backyard, but they better not be using it. 
irritating some dogs, whatever they're doing. Yeah, I got a hole there. Big hole there. Hole under there, hole there. Every time I move dirt, I'm uncovering more. That one. There's no fixing this tank. I can't believe how thin this thing is. Ah, I don't like being stuck. Yeah, because even if I want to convert it to a fuel cell, it's going to cost the same amount of money. Golly. So let's inspect the brakes. <laughs> Isuzu. Uh, yeah, but look at... Two brake lines coming out, but then you have... Yeah. <laughs> this is, okay, what's under here? Oh, Full and clean. Did we put fluid in here last time? No, no we didn't touch the brakes at all. Oh, well, yeah, we did, because that's fresh. Oh. Unless you did when I wasn't here. Um, let's pump the brakes and see if the master works. I think we did, because you were talking about bleeding the brakes and we never got around to it. Yeah, let's see, see if any bubbles come out. He <laughs> bubbles. Here we go again with the bubbles. Why does it feel like it has pedal? <laughs> I don't know, there's no bubbles. No. Nothing? We could try opening a bleeder valve and see if anything comes out anywhere. Oh, yeah, it's right there. It is days later. I don't know where we left off, what we did. Oh, I do know we found a very holy gas tank. This one is blown out everywhere. So, Vivian did a shout out trying to find us one. So if you didn't see that shout out, we're trying to find one. We're gonna see if we can do our best to find an original gas tank. If not, we might build a new one. We might just get a fuel cell for the bed or I don't know, beer kegs, something because no of the, none of the companies that make aftermarket tanks, for some reason they don't make this tank. And going across all the forums and checking everything out, I'm really surprised they'd be sitting on a gold mine if they made this tank, because apparently everybody <laughs> with a Chevy Love that has this tank needs one. Uh, they're gold. I found one available on eBay. I am not paying that price, because I can build one a lot cheaper than it's $500 plus two something for ship, it's 700 and something dollars for a piece of metal that holds gas when I've got access to build one. So I'm not gonna do that. So, and nobody should have to do that. That is that is major price gouging. There's <laughs> nothing that constitutes paying that much for that when you can build one. So we're gonna go that route because yeah, I refused, I refused to, to pay the, that kind of price. Um, well, break wise, it's raining, so bear with me. Popped a new master cylinder on got it bled, bench bled and everything. And yeah, I think the, we're not getting fluid to the back. So I don't know if it's the rubber hose or the actual wheel cylinders, but we're gonna go ahead and change the wheel cylinders, do brakes, uh, go through the front brakes. 
The rubber hoses, uh, running into a problem trying to find those. They are special order everywhere. Um, if this was a two wheel drive, easily accessible, but I guess four wheel drives are more rare. Um, I didn't think they were because down here in Texas, there's a lot of four wheel drives and I've seen a lot of people tell me they have never seen a four wheel drive love. Well, down here in Texas, they're everywhere. There's like three for sale right down the road. Um, so that's where we are on that. So I guess the main part of this video was to diagnose the fuel system eh, and the brake system. Yeah. Um, yeah, well, I inspect the drums on the back, the rotors in the front, check the calipers. Uh, yeah. But that being said, for the age of this truck and how long it sat and in the woods with a door wide open and a tree growing through it, I'm surprised it's in this good a shape. Um, I mean, there's no water damage, no rust of floorboards, nothing. It's very solid. So, um, this of course will be a multi-part video all the way up until hopefully we hit 100,000 subscribers. And then when we hit 100,000 subscribers, we're gonna do a drawing to see who wins this truck. So that gives us enough time to go through it front to back. Uh, once we get it on the road, probably drive it a little bit, make sure it's uh, you know solid and safe and all that stuff. And then we're gonna do some little fixing ups on it, put some new cool tires, off-road tires on it, uh, all-terrain something, maybe lift it a little bit. Uh, yeah, all that kind of stuff. So I think, uh, unfortunately, that's where we have to stop for right now. But we'll be back. It's uh, Christmas holidays, so if you celebrate Christmas, Hanukkah, whatever, Hope you enjoy your holidays. Um, on another note, we will finally, for the first time in the years we've been here, have high-speed internet supposed to be installed Wednesday morning. So it looks like maybe next weekend I've got to get with the girls and see if we can do a live stream with you guys and hang out. What are you doing, Muppet? Nothing. <laughs> so... We're going to go do our holiday stuff. We've got to do all the things and then get with family and everything on Monday. So we're going to wrap up here and say happy holidays, Merry Christmas, happy Hanukkah, and whatever else people celebrate around the world. And uh, we'll be back uh, next week at some point, maybe finishing this up. If not, um, we've got plenty of projects laying around here. We'll find something to work on. Uh, I ordered tires for Sally back here. So we can get her at least out of the garage for now and get the engine for her, the new engine pulled out of the pile in the back of the garage, start going through that. We need to start going through the engine for Hulk, getting it ready, because um, I've been really anxious to drive that truck. And yeah, so we love you guys and we will see you again, uh, hopefully next week.